In this video, we will see how we can install plugins in Jenkins. Now this video will be the continuation of the last video in which we have created the users and we faced a problem. The problem was all users were having same access to all the projects and we wanted to restrict the access to the user based upon his role. So for that we wanted to install some plugin and this plugin we will install in this video. So to install plugins in Jenkins we need to go to the manage Jenkins page. So just click on manage Jenkins and then when you scroll down you will be able to see this section which says manage plugins. So just click on the manage plugins section and you will be able to see uh, four tabs here. First tab is for updates. So whatever plugins are already installed at the time of installation, you will see uh, the update information of uh, the plugins which have the updates. So if you want to update, for example, this Apache HTTP components client uh, plugin, you can just uh, check on this and then you can say uh, download now and install after restart. But we want to install a new plugin. So we will go into this section which says available. So in available section, there are many plugins which are available. And for now to restrict the access of the project to the users and groups, we need to install a plugin called role based authentication strategy. So you can just filter the, these plugins using this search box. So just uh, write role for example and all the plugins will be shown which have the keyword role and there is only one plugin available which is role based authentication strategy and this is the plugin we want to install. So we will check this checkbox and if we want to know more about this role based authentication strategy plugin I will right click on this link and I will uh, open this uh, in the next tab or new tab and you will be able to see more information about this plugin. So you can see this is the website plugins.jenkins.io role strategy and you can see about this plugin and you can see the introduction about this plugin. So this plugin adds a new role based strategy to use and fasten user management. So it can create global roles, it can create project roles, it can create slave roles and also assigning these roles to the user. So here also you will be able to find more information about this plugin and how to use this plugin also you will be able to see the documentation about this plugin when you scroll down. Now there are two ways of installing plugins. One way is to search in your Jenkins in the available tab and you will be able to find the plugin and then we will click this button which says download now and install after restart or the, the second way of installing the plugin is I'm going to show you. So for example, we want to install this dependency which says matrix authentication strategy. I'm going to open this in the next tab and the, in this tab you will be able to see when you scroll uh, down the latest release of this plugin. So I'm going to click on the latest release which is going to download the dot hpi file so this uh, plugin is called matrix auth dot hpi file is the plugin right so we are going to save this uh, plugin and once this uh, file is downloaded this hpi file is downloaded we will go to the jenkins and you will be able to see this advanced tab here and in the advanced tab when you scroll down a little you will be able to see this option which says upload plugins and you will be able to just click on this button which says browse and then just select your HPI file and upload this file. And in this way, you will be able to install that plugin also. Now we are going to install our plugin using uh, the Jenkins in the available tab. So I'm going to once again search for uh, the role based 
authentication strategy. I'm going to just check on this checkbox and I'm going to click on this button which says download now and install after restart. And then you will be able to see this uh, page which says installing plugins or upgrades. And then it says role based authentication strategy downloaded successfully. We need to restart our Jenkins. So we will just check on this checkbox which says restart Jenkins when installation is complete. So I'm going to just check on this checkbox. So it's going to restart the Jenkins once this plugin is installed. So I'm going to wait for some time until this Jenkins is restarted. And now I can see this message which says, please wait while Jenkins is getting ready to work after the restart. And now the Jenkins has been restarted, I think. So we need to log in with our credentials and I'm going to say login. And after I logged into the Jenkins, I'm going to go to the manage Jenkins section. So I'm going to click on manage Jenkins. And then I will go to the manage plugins section. And then once the plugin is installed, you will be able to see it in the installed tab. So I'm going to click on installed. And then I'm going to search for a role based authentication strategy. You can see uh, this plugin here, which says role based authentication strategy. So this plugin is now installed. So now we can use this plugin.